chain. I came up with an idea. I came up with an idea. I opened the door and I fell down. I, I just said, okay, let me just finish. Let's be fit. At least they will carry me to the health center. Maybe the clinic. Let me just go somewhere. Feel like I ain't give you a waste in a minute. I'm about to see a place with ya. So that I don't need a frame in my back. Wait. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome. If you're new, welcome to my channel. I'm Toria G. And if you're a returning subscriber, welcome back, guys. Hope you guys have been good. So today, from the title, you already know mini story time. The most embarrassing embarrassing day of my life and let's get straight to the video so i'm very hungry okay. so it's all happened in just three g is a story secondary school of course And beside my class it was another class, of course, and my crush was in that class. And obviously, when you when your crush is there, when you pass, you know, it's for me to have languages like Yoruba and Igbo. And I was a Yoruba student. I am Yoruba. I was a Yoruba student. And normally, the class beside you, like the Yoruba student to stay in one class, the Igbo student to stay in another class. And apparently. My crush was Yoruba. So, hmm. so I it was time for the class now. Oh, we move for the class, and I think it was test or assignment. She had got zero in something, or well, I didn't do it. I can't remember. But she had, it was fail. Then she was this flow was this flowed me. So if you failed, the woman it was a woman. The woman will flog you like it's going to be rolled by rolled. You kneel down. <laughs> you kneel down, and they will flog you. So everybody kneel down. People that feel, of course. And I was part. Everybody kneel kneel down, and like we're moving now. You know, as the queue goes, uh -huh, we were moving. We're moving now. Then I was like, Jesus, I can't. Like I can't be flogged in front of this guy. I already know that that one's bad enough, but like to be flogged, I said no. I said what? No. I can't. I can't be flogged. So I had to think of something to do. Like I was thinking, like I couldn't be flogged. I couldn't be flogged. I, I just can't be flogged in front of this guy. Maybe that was really very embarrassing. So I. I was thinking, then I excused myself, I went to the toilet, I mean that I locked myself. I stayed there, I was thinking that I can't, I was sweating. It wasn't normal. And this was just a crush. Oh my boyfriend, I need a crush. So, I was thinking, I was thinking, I was thinking, I was thinking that I, I locked myself in there, of course. Then, as I was there, I didn't even know I spent like a long time there. Girls came to for me that would not manage to for me. I said, Jesus, hey, I can't be flogged. No, no, no. Then I came up with an idea. I came up with an idea. I opened the door and I fell down. I, I just said, okay, let me just finish. Let's be fit. At least they will carry me to the health center, maybe the clinic. Let me just go somewhere, not be flogged. I fell down. And I, I don't know how they didn't realize that it was fake because I was still blinking. Not blinking, but like my eyes were still moving. And I fell down shot, I fell down on the floor. And they were they went to call the woman and ma da 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 and fan to fan me and I was not thinking that is this how they will keep me like in my head now like this is how they will keep me there they should tell me to go clean they should carry me somewhere let me just go away from here and not be flogged that was the main goal objective 
So the body hand fan funny 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 then I just said, okay, let me just stand up. Let me just be there. Let me just, you know, because I was there. They were not going to do anything. That's how it looked like. So I stood up. I took it out. I, like I was fine. Then the mom started laughing. She started laughing. She was like, so it's because she had it in Yoruba. So it's because of Kane. A bit because of me vlogging you. That you fainted. Hey! I didn't say anything. I was just there. I was just there. Then the man told me to go to the clinic. Now she was going to class, she was now, and her voice is loud. She now said it. She now, she now seeing it outside. I, I didn't know that. I didn't know that I would have gone through worse. I would have just stayed with let me be flogged or what happened. I was there. But at that time I didn't realize. I, I was moving to the clinic. I was going. And I, I passed through the corridor opposite my class. So I didn't pass my side because the guy was staying beside the window. <laughs> was staying beside the window. And I was going to the clinic. Everybody in class. Because I looked at the class. Everyone was looking at me. And everyone was quiet. Like nobody was talking. Then I said, oh, so I was going. I think one boy said something. Then everybody started laughing. Jesus. I wanted the ground to open up and take me in. I didn't know. I just kept on moving. Just I was happy that oh, okay, oh, at least I'm in the clinic where I wanted to be goal achieved, you know, objective achieved. I don't know. I I came back from the clinic. I didn't. I don't think I went to the clinic. Said. I went somewhere else or the clinic. I don't know. I came back. I don't know when I'm gone. Then I don't know. People are asking me questions. Da, oh, da 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 da. da should I? I think I had to pretend, and I didn't really think that I was going to say this like one day, but I planned that okay, well, this is forever in my heart. Nobody was here because it was very embarrassing. Because how they put it is like, oh, my dear friend here because because of tests or because they wanted to flog her. You get so. Oh, that's that's the most embarrassing day. One of the days I will never forget. One of the, one of them, one of them, one of them. Say, so, okay, guys, that has been up until now. I think a lot doesn't happen in my life. So that has been my most embarrassing moment up until now. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Look at this cutie. Mm, cutie. <laughs> Get me walk, please. Now. Yeah. I, yeah, I said. Yeah, I said so. What do you want to do about it? About it? What? Okay guys, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, turn on my post notifications and stay tuned for another video. Obviously there will be more story times, obviously. More story times. More story times. So, don't forget to do the needful guys. Bye.